Hey everybody, what's happening? Shadow Kiss, welcome back to more Pokemon Reborn. Last time, we took on both Bennett and Luna in Iolia Valley. Defeated them both, retrieved the Eclipse Badge from Luna. This time, we're going to continue on to Agate City as suggested to follow Kane. Warning you, as I did at the end of the last episode, if there's things you want to do outside of Agate City, right now, you want to get hit those done now. There are several side quests that become undoable after this point in the game. If you want to do those, you have to do them now. Okay? Unfortunately, I don't have any more to do. So I will go straight north to the Agate City checkpoint. Hey, these guys are still conked out for whatever reason. You think something happened? If we go past here, there's no telling what could happen. It may even be a long time before we can come back. Are you sure you're ready? Alright, Nido King. Knock knock, open up the door, we're here. I mean, that works I guess. Come on. With that, we can go forward. I think we'll be saying goodbye to Reborn City for a while. It's quiet. Too quiet. Okay, what's going on here? Hello, anyone there? Hmm, dead silent. That's typically not a good sign. Wait a second. Is that... No way! Aya! What are you doing all the way up here? Hey, Aya, wake up! Answer me! Aya? Heh. <laughs> but what a weird place to fall asleep. Dork. I don't know, but I'm not gonna leave here for here, but I'm kind of I kinda of feel tired myself. I think I'll just take a nap and wait for her to wake up. Uh Hey, do you hear something? You notice the screen getting darker as we're falling asleep. Diamond Dynamo Whoa! Uh... Whoops. That was close. What do you think you're doing? What am I doing? What are you doing? This Saturday night, baby, I'd like to take you out. Know what I mean? Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Usually people ask that before they try to pound me, not after. Okay, no, hold on. What did you just do with that giant melon? You wanna find out? Like, really? What? Where could that have possibly have gone? He's checking me out. Oh, yeah. I. Please tell me I'm not this bad, Chad. Anyway, as I was saying, <laughs> you gotta get out of here. Why? And who even are you? I'm Terra, hear me, Var. Terra, acceptable alternate names include Terra, Terraria. Terrar, rar, 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 rar. Mega Terrar, Super Lead Lion Tamar, and Queen O Booty. And I got some sweet, sweet words of sugar for you, baby. Oh, yeah, so lend me your ear real close, like. Get out of here! Is any bony who stick around going to fall right asleep, yo? This character is honestly hilarious. I laugh every time. Exhibits A and C. There was an exhibit B, but I ate him. Delicious. Who's, what? Who said that? Is it because of this place that everyone falls asleep? Correct the mundo, you win! Your prize is a brand new car! Da -da -da -da. But I ate the car too. Whoops. Now get. The W. Though I got two friends up one way first class ride to safety. Let me explain. Tara, what are you doing? Your mom lol. Bad or up? Home ah. What the fuck is a physics? It's no worry, they are safe. We sing Hakuna Matatas and go join them, yeah? 
Ready? I think I'll walk, thank you. Just tell me where you sent Tyra. Maybe you won't be able to walk after I'm done with you. You might be surprised. Come on, let's get out of here before we fall asleep too. I can already feel it. Fine. All troops, move out! So, you went from being a pony, or a lion, to a lion tamer, to a queen of booty, to a pony, and now you're pit. Excellent! Did you see her spinning as she walked? And here it is, the famous Agate Circus. It's no sleepy people here. So I guess you're one of the clowns then? wrong -o, I am a fierce lion tamer! I also tame seal, if you know what I mean. Anyway, your friendly peach probably fell around this joint somewhere. I'm gonna go hit the showers. Cha-cha real smooth. Do you think she's okay? I, uh, I mean, after being knocked over a mountain by a giant mallet. Point taken. Let's just split up and find her, okay? Mm-hmm. There are trainers here that'll battle you. There's also a shop here that sells ultra potions. These are better than super potions and we want to stock up on plenty. While I'm here, since I don't have to cheat active, I'm going to take the opportunity to sell things I don't need anymore, such as all my super potions. Actually, that's not everything that I need to sell, because I derped. Let's see, there was also... Where are my... Suns for star pieces. I have four of these to sell. I have four rare bones to sell. And I have one stardust somewhere. No, two stardusts even. Nice. Okay, so that's all that. Don't need to buy anything else from you. This guy pledges or does the Pledge of Allegiance, if you get what my blah blah blah, what I mean. Ultra Ball or. Yeah, you don't sell anything else of use. Now coming over here, cotton candy for sale, if you need to restock on that, which I... Oh, hiccups suddenly. I think I actually do need to restock on it once. I'm already running low on money. By the way, battle. Also, you notice, there's a hailstorm here in Agate Circus. We went from sun, to rain, to hail. The weather in this game is very dynamic, yes. Ball Choi down. Of course, Noble's probably going down now from Hale, so yeah. Anyway, skipping to end of battle. The AI in this game always try to use their strongest possible move. This doesn't always mean their strongest possible move is the most useful one. Right here, we have a free... Um... Or we have a move tutor. Oh man! I forgot to go give the key back to the move tutor. If you do that, you get a free usage of the move tutor plus good karma. Unfortunately, I forgot. We can't do that once we get back, which is a shame. Oh! This is a pain. We have a tile puzzle. It's for Tortuga. Unfortunately, we don't have any need to do that. Right here. Ability capsules are sold. Right here. These guys sell air balloons. Which is an interesting item to be sold, but it is a circus after all. Quick nice treat, this guy sells common candy, all the kinds of candies. Right here we have a healing unit, we have a circus lady dude person. You know, I'm fairly sure you can get back to other places that you've been if you heal here or don't heal here and then lose. Which is the only way you can get back past Age Circus. Unfortunately, I also don't think any cutscene allows you to get back, so... That might be a little game-breaking, I don't know. I'd love to test it eventually, but that would mean I'd have to go all the way back here. Ew. I'm not exactly on break, so don't tell anyone. And we're back. By the way, the only thing we'll have access to once we return to Reborn City is... The Black Market. That will be... Pretty much the only thing that won't have access changed. So, if you want to do that, okay, I suggest still saving up things for that. Right here, 
Oh, you're still the balloon guy. Another battle. And that was that. Right here, we have a very bored look, Ray. Doesn't seem like Pokemon like this either. Right here, this guy guesses hidden power. Usually to perfection. This guy is a name raider. Chance to win a free fossil Pokemon as the last one was Tortuga. This one will be Archin. However, we don't need either. As you can tell by them setting up you up with a lot of different systems, it's very unlikely that you'll ever or that you'll be returning to Reborn anytime soon. We just ran out of repels. I'm going to buy some more while we're right here. If I could talk to the guy, thank you. Just buy a few spams worthy of these. Oh, and uh, I'll shorten the amount of Ultra Balls I get because I do want to get some escape ropes. That is the lowest you'll ever see my money. Either way, we have one more battle to get through or not. Oh no, I guess Circus uses shards as currency. In fact, the entire fair is built on them. Care for a little history? No. You ready to take the Rainbow Challenge? Face off against one of our patent color dra themed drawn teams in the ring and win yourself a new shard thing. Not to mention the usual cash prize, if you hear me. You hear me? This is a battle for a shard. This shard will be a yellow shard. Opening with an Archaeops. The team changes depending on what color it lands on. In this case, it is Archaeops, however, it in this case, the Pokemon is yellow. That hurt. Smoke the sound. Dang. Calm Mind isn't gonna do that. Dang! I don't like this thing. Let's try getting a hit off, except it's probably gonna take down Pandora. Nope. Archaeops sound. I know it's Arch Archaeops or Archops, but Ar Archaeops sounds better. Just, you know, archaic. Yeah. Pandora down. Fortunately, Nunjask, Ninjask, sorry, not Nunjask, isn't going to be easy to beat with my current Pokemon. Heck, it'll be extremely easy, actually. But speed wise, nothing can beat it. Actually, dang, it's doing some damage. Um, Iron Tail then. Try to weaken its defense for someone else. Noble being my fastest Pokemon, being outsped by this. Yeah, we have issues. I'm showing this battle because it's sort of important. It's just to show off something here. Fortunately, it doesn't look like it's quite going my way. Did it, eh? We can have Rennie out for that. Get Leech Seed. That's not gonna do that much. And then Giga Drain. Not even a crit can save you now. This dead end is down. We have a winner. Ding ding ding. Free shard. Blah blah blah. Okay, I'm gonna quickly do the money cheat because there's something that I want to show off here that requires money. Okay, I did that. Now we have to get into a battle. Well, we just had our first unfortunate loss. That's quite okay. Of course, we have another force battle over here anyway. Stay down and stay out of my way. Okay, let's quickly heal up again. Get out of my way, you stupid Don fan. Okay, now, well, ignoring up this guy who sells Poké Snacks, this person who sells ice cream, and this person who... Actually, this is completely necessary. 
Unfortunately, this is a little challenging of a puzzle. I think I remember which way it goes, but if not, we might have issues. Okay, that is one of the top pieces, while this one goes over here. Oh wait, that's two eyes. No, okay there. And then there's that, except this piece needs to not be there. Up there, I believe, is this piece instead. Nope. Okay, so that's not the piece that I need up there. Said maybe this one? No, that's not it either. This puzzle always gets me. There. That's how you need that. Now this goes over here. Yes, yes, okay. There's another piece of the face that goes right here. That's not it. Okay, there is that. I ha don't know why I always have trouble with this. It's a very simple puzzle. Also, unfortunately, doesn't tell you which way the puzzle goes. So, I did this correctly on several occasions. But there was an issue that the game had with how I did it. I did it, according to the game, backwards. Or rather, not the right way. This has to be done perfectly according to the game. And if you do not, well... You can kiss your attempt goodbye. Okay, let's see. That goes there. That's another piece out of the way. That doesn't go there, but I need to move that up there so it's out of the way. This is a body piece. Not that way. Not that way. Okay, so maybe that doesn't go there. That goes there. Yeah? Yeah. And here's part of a leg, so that goes there, that cuts that out. That goes there, but I need to move this over here and get the piece that goes over here to be there. I think that's this piece up here. Yeah. Yeah. No, wait. That there is a part of the throw key, so no. This over here, maybe? That looks about right. Now I need to spin that, and that's in the right place. Okay, so these four tiles are left. This goes over here, maybe? Clearly not. That goes there. That does that. Okay, that's the puzzle done. And I did it on camera. Oh yeah. We now earned dive. This is a physical water move? I think we know who to teach this to. Bye, Sire, if you would. Learn dive. Perfect. So that gets having to learn dive out of the way, right here. That's a way to earn timber for a purple shard. This is a money sort of thing. For 350. Waymo, nice. You get your money back for earning nice. You get nothing for earning weak. For hitting over 9,000 and breaking the bell. You get swagger. However, there's a third prize if you get powerful on this that I do want to show off. Unfortunately, it does this RNG style. Really, you just have to get lucky. 
I'll probably skip ahead until I get it after a few more tries on camera. Character, you're a wimp. Powerful, there we go. Not bad, congratulations. Your prize is one of Gate Circus's Clavery dolls. This is the Poké doll that makes you instantly be able to run away. However, on the first try, suddenly, how'd the real Clefairy get in there? Well, uh, why don't you just take this and we don't speak of this to my suit privately? Sound good? You obtained a Clefairy in a very strange way. I don't exactly have any characters of that line, nor do I plan to use it, but Clefairy is an amazingly poke or an amazing poke line. Here's where you learn a few specialized attacks, however we don't need that. You want some new toys? Okay, well, no thank you. Right here. And um, as a result, we just need to assure everyone that everything is probably okay. We hope. Oh, um, hi, how can I help you? Oh, you're here for the girl? That's great! See, everyone, everything's under control. It was super weird, this girl sailed right over the ride and landed it plop in the middle of the circus. And a moment later, everyone who looked up saw a boy fly straight across the circus. We don't quite know where he landed yet. Don't worry though, the girl survived. Somehow. Don't really know how, to be honest. And we'll find the boy too. Huh, you mean it was Terra who- Well, that explains everything. Now we have to find them, or he'll make the circus look bad. Oh, sorry, I didn't properly introduce myself. Hi, I'm the ringmaster of the Age Circus. At the Age Circus, we bring you the big top-tier entertainments. It's an experience that you that can't be bought and guaranteed to make your jaw drop. Draw drop, actually. I mean, jaw drop. Damn it! Sorry, I'm still new to this. My father was the original ringmaster, but he just... Well, he's not around. Never mind that. To be honest, we're kind of having a rough time. I gate city had to be closed because everyone who passed through would fall asleep and not wake up. And as such, we can't get any business from Agate or Reborn City. It's been tough to keep going, and now Terra's causing problems again. But we will definitely all get through this, okay? Anyway, hey, I had Samson carry the girl into the back room so she could be treated. I have to finish up here, so go ask him to take you to her. He usually hangs around the High Striker. So, everything's going wrong here, too. Right here, this guy wasn't here before. High Striker, up to go. Win prizes. Or something. Let me demonstrate. Ha! And whammo! Your power level is... Over 9,000! Not bad, huh? Great. Time for another new bell. Name Samson. Circus Strongman. My Pokemon do most of the work for the main shows, but as you can see, I ain't a lightweight. Anyway, you look like you want something. What's up? Oh, yeah, the girl? I carried her into our back room just a minute ago. It's in the big top. I'll take you back there. Meet me at the front. Dang it! During this battle, Kara learned Loon Blast over Draining Kiss. Get out of my way, bingo! Crowd's annoying. Hey, move it! After you. That just clears the line for us. So sorry everyone, but I'm afraid that's all she wrote. Do come back for our next show. Oh, Samson. Is this the boy they were talking about? I'm surprised he's conscious. This is... Actually, I forgot to ask their name. I'm not unctuous as always, hmm, Samson? My name is Seal. Tara mentioned Seal. I'm the star or spotlit starlet of this arcade circus specialty show. Aerial Ballet is my forte. Be right back. If Skype would just remain on this Do Not Disturb for one recording. Sorry.
It's a pleasure to meet you, darling. Anyway, Shadow's here for the girl. Oh, superb. I was worried no one would claim her. Follow me. She's back this way. She's your friend, right? Hey everyone, we've got another visitor. Ah, yeah. By the way, is something with Terra? She just ran up, punched our showers, and ran off. Aya, can you hear me? Are you okay? Please wake up. Uh, I feel like shit. Kane? Thank goodness. It's been a while. Yeah, sorry about that. How's mom? Don't ask. Where's Hardy? Ah, that must have been the other boy who we observed soaring not quite so elegantly above the circus. Hardy was supposed to show me to his gym. That's why we went up to Age, but I can't remember what happened when we got there. Something in the city conked the both of you. It's been closed off ever since. We found you sleeping in the middle of the street. I almost fell asleep too, but then Terra happened. Apologies for her. <laughs> she may be rambunctious, but we do have to keep her around. After all, it wouldn't be the Age Circus to lose one of its famous gym leaders. With Samson joining us, we're the newly called Age Ace Triumphrit. That's right, gym battles make fantastic shows. Flying type leader at your service. Terra's the ground type, and Samson has newly joined us on the fighting type. Except, very kind of the last leader to retire all of a sudden. I've been waiting for this. It wasn't really like that at all. So, Hardy isn't here? Nuh uh. He probably fell somewhere on Route 2. Then we should go find him. You seem to like this guy, don't hold ya. What? No, it's not like that. I'm just worried, that's all. And I know he would do the same for us. Let's go. Negative. Or negative, little lady, you sit right down. I'm surprised you can even walk after what Terra put you through. I'm afraid I must agree. I don't want to send you all in your condition. Shad, would you mind going to look for Hardy? I kind of want to catch up with Aya for a little. I probably owe it to her. <laughs> Oh, if you're going on round two, you'll probably need a powder veil. Vial. You'll see why. We usually have quite a few people passing through, so we'll sell them at the front. Then it's settled. Not that I miss him or anything, but please hurry and find Hardy. Hey, I. You know I'm sorry for pushing all that stuff on you, right? If you were really sorry, you wouldn't have done it. No need to sing. Just stop. Were those stupid songs of yours enough to shove us out of your mind entirely? Of course not. But I made a choice on my own well-being. So there's no point in feeling guilty for it. I didn't mean to saddle you with so much responsibility, but I couldn't deal with Mom anymore. Uh-huh. You think she got any more tolerable after you left? She practically denies your existence now. Her yelling hasn't stopped. The only difference is it's not about you anymore. Right. Well, it's whatever. At least one of us can be happy this way. And if I didn't have to take your position, I might not have met Hardy. Ooh, so he makes you happy, huh? It's not like that. Sure. Conversations between these people are funny. Right here. Oh. Skip through all this and talk to Aya. So, this Hardy guy. I know what you're going to say, and you may as well not say it. Shaw, <laughs> don't be like that. Tell me about him. After all, I'm going to need to know who to beat up if he hurts you. That's what brothers are supposed to do, right? Brothers aren't supposed to run away from home. Ouch. He's the Yage City Rock Leader. He came down to help me settle into my new job. You know, the one you totally dumped on me. Okay, okay, I get it, I'm sorry. Put your claws away. We're working on figuring out what kind of puzzle my gym should have. Because I guess every gym has to have a puzzle, is that strange? Anyway, he said he'd take me up and show me to his gym. His gym puzzle is simple. Then this happened. You still haven't told me anything about him. Is he cute? 
I mean, he... What kind of question is that? Ah, <laughs> so he is. I didn't say that. You didn't deny it. That doesn't mean it's true. Is it true? That I... Maybe. Use protection. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm going to extend this episode to allow these conversations. I don't think this... Con oh yes, this is a conversation, but too late now. I saw you perk up at the mention of the leaders earlier. So, you're a challenger. Then I should tell you about our special challenge rules. Everyone in their Pikachu would just be challenging the leaders all the time if they could, and then we'd never get to use Fake Top Space for anything else. So, in order to face one of the Agate's Triumvirate, you need a special battle pass. We sent some passes out as a promotion, and you can also have a chance to win them from circus games or other events. So stick around and get to playing! As you can see, her ad campaign is something else. Oh shush you. Well, I think after all that, it's a good point to end off the episode, okay? Next time on Pokemon Reborn, we're going to go out and search for Hardy on round two. I'll see you guys then. Shadikiss, signing out.